What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be playing Empire Total War and I'm going to be trying to make the Dutch East India Company great again. Let's get into it, shall we? Hopefully the volume's good in this first playthrough. Gonna have to continually your first adjust. Should be to defend your home region. And we gotta turn her off. Hang on one second, let me turn down the game audio a bit. I think it's a little loud. I think that should be good. Yes. Now let's make sure we turn off Miss Helper. That's not it. There it is. No, no. Very good. Resume. All right. Here we are in the United Provinces. And I've already tried this once and failed, so we're going to have to try our best to keep our trade routes clear and build up some trade fleets that can go and do my bidding across the world. Okay, so first order of business. Let's upgrade this. We're going to have to take care of some pirates here. I think we should probably build a few more ships before we do that. So let's just get a few ships here. And let's also recruit some line infantry. Because we're going to be taking care of some pirates. Gives us some extra money. Gives us some what we need. And then let's just check in in India. We've got a nice little ship here. Enter in Kamali. And then we also start in the East Indies with our nice, huge trade fleet. With two amazing flutes here. Flutes. And armed. Merchantman is... 142. A flute. And the Indiaman. But this is a larger Indian. This is larger. Right. Alright. So that's going to be it for this turn. Let's just go back to Europe so we can watch. And end turn. So last time I was in this game, France declared war on me. Um, well, I actually declared war on them through an ally. But this time I'm going to back out of my alliances. And we're going to try to keep things calm. And just kind of mind our business as much as we can. Deal with the pirates first and deal with all the other politics later. Trade is the most important thing to the United Provinces, to the Dutch East India Company. And that's what we're going to focus on in this Let's Play. Okay, the pirates did something. Okay, Poland, Lithuania, we got some of them. Let's go take a look over here, because I think our pirates just took a port. Yep. Okay, so we can blockade them, actually. And do this. I believe we should have this in the bag. We'll do a quick save. Should we auto-resolve or attack? I think we're going to attack. Let's do it. Our first battle has the Dutch East India Company. The United Provinces. First thing we're going to do, group them up, get them in a formation, take a look where the line, where the wind is blowing, excuse me, I think that looks pretty good actually, and deployment, and go like this. We're actually going to double speed it. Let's try that. Let's see what they're doing. Can fast forward a little bit while we catch up. And here we go. 
Dutch East India Company fighting our first set of pirates. Oh dear lord, that is not good. Let's just go this way then. Why is that all bugged? I don't get that. What in the hell? That's bugged out. No, 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 no. You continue. Continue. Alright, let's ungroup them. Group them. Alright, now we go. For some reason that got bugged. And I don't know why. But we're okay now. And they're gonna start firing. Perfect. Very good. Let's turn around. Can make another pass. Is this guy gonna fire? Probably not. Whatever. It happens. Alright, let's fast forward this, turn them around, and actually go this way. I uh, see he's getting a little bit shot up here. It's alright. What the hell? Apologies for that. Windows just had a rain aneurysm there. Alright, let's play. Alright, here we go. There we go. Excellent. There we go. Breaking them already. Is he going to fire anytime soon, or...? Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. The answer... is always yes. That's a sloop. That's a brig. It's a brig. We got a fifth rate, a sixth rate, and a sloop. Alright, so we're doing good. They're going to focus down this ship, which is what I want. Keep him in your sights. I want you sinking him. He's sunk. Good. Alright, now we curve. Now we curve him up. Oh yeah, that's what I call shipbuilding. All right, here we go. Finish off these pesky pirates. There we go, broke him.
and he missed. Pirates can't aim. The Dutch East India Company always wins. Guess we can turn them around. Yeah, let's just attack and speed it up. And he broke me. There we go. We came back. All right. Good battle. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that brief intermission. Had to take care of something. I guess we'll do a little Weaver's Cottage here. 450 to region wealth. That seems enticing, but I do want to check what this does. 800 to... We to yeah, yeah, the gem pit is where you need to go. That's a good upgrade. Um... Do I want a barracks? Get some VOC infantry and stuff. Which we don't really need over here unless we're going to be conquering India. I think we're going to hold off. But I definitely do want to recruit a larger fleet so we can clear out some of those pirates. So we'll do that. And we can just put these guys here for now. Great. The Dutch are in a really interesting situation because you can't really defeat your enemies. You have to play this game really smart. Because, you, you know, I only have a one province homeland. Captain Kidd is dead. Prussia and Austria. Got a couple Indiamen. Perfect. Um, we're going to hold off on that region. Let's check America. There's just... Our area here, ah, this is what we need. Deep gem shaft. Minus one happiness. But it's got that plus 1500 wealth. So I think that's definitely going to happen. This is okay here. We got plenty of stuff. So let's definitely do that. It's a lot of money, but I think it's going to be worth it in the end of the day. So let's do that. And we can also make sure that our navy is fully resupplied. Rebuilt, I mean, excuse me. We're also going to have to recruit some navies over here in order to conquer the pirates, but we'll take care of that on the next turn. Because we have our home here. Let's just put these guys here. And here's our home fleet, which is fine. And we're going to get our new trade trading fleet to go out. But the thing we need to do is keep all these trade routes clear so that we can get our money from the East Indies. But unfortunately, if we look, we're currently blockaded. 
raided, excuse me, from East India and India. So we need to take care of these pirates. That's pretty much goal number one. And that's what killed me when I did not win last time. But we know what to do now. I've learned. Spain is at war. There's the Barbary States going down to Chinatown. And the Maratha Confederacy. At war with the Mughal Empire. Uh, and now we can see our wealth is really going to be going up 4,000 next turn. But a lot of that is due to the trade income. So we can't let that be blockaded. We need that money. There's a new sloop that we recruited. So this is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 ship navy. So what we can do is go here. We need to make sure that we recruit those 5 ships in order to, you know, make that happen. Deep gem shaft here. I think that's also going to be worth it, to be honest. But again, it's it's only if those things are kept. So this is 4454, 1938. But this is much more. Ex oh no, it's not. The flute is better than the Indiaman. I just wonder what the trade capacity is. You know. I don't really know what that uh, what that does, how that works. I've not researched it, but it does look bigger than the Indiaman. One hundred and forty-two men, fifty-four men. Hmm, interesting, and it's definitely more. Maneuverable. Maybe if we build a few flutes, we can send them into the Straits of Madagascar and do some trading. So maybe we'll do that, and they can also defend themselves. I think that's a good, pretty good, pretty good plan. They're expensive, but we can build one or two, or see what we can do. Because we've got a big navy here, quite a few sloops. Why am I building so many sloops? They only have 18 guns. Let's build flutes. They're much better. 18 guns are... That's what they are. There. So we're going to build some flutes, and we're going to see where that takes us. I like that idea. Sloops suck. Get some trade, kill some pirates, it'll all be great. We'll, we'll have a great time. Agent assassinated. Well, that just sucks, doesn't it? Three color printing. Wow, that's amazing. Unit recruited. Crimea, they always get killed early on. Let's get another flute. This is going to be a great navy right here. This is going to be a great navy. One more flute. What, a five? Okay. We can go with deep gem mine shaft. We might do that. We might do that. Let's let's see what this fleet has. Four Indiamans and two flutes. So yeah, that'll be good. Let's go to America. Let's recruit something here. Some brigs. A couple of brigs. And then we can conquer the pirates. Let's get a little bit of an army going. Perfect. Barbary states are done. The navy's getting sunk faster than 
water itself. we go. So let's take a look over here. Are there any trade routes close to the coast of Brazil? Mm, I don't think so. I don't think we're going to involve ourselves with that too much. But definitely over in India, we're going to want to get our Dutch East Indies trading company. East Indies is over here. I wonder if we use another trade post, we can double that up. Actually, let's see what everything is worth. 21, 37 ivory. Where can I get ivory from is the question. I don't know. And we really need to unblockade our sea routes. But our America sugar is doing well. It's only 15 is the problem. Where can we get ivory? That is my question. We need to figure that out. It's probably on the Ivory Coast. I mean, I'm just guessing here. <laughs> I'm just guessing. But probably, if I had to take a wild guess, I'd say Ivory Coast. Let's get some more fleets. Because they look real good. I like them. And let's check in one more time with America. See what we can do here. How's this doing? That's not a problem. Got our army, our navy. Could get another one more brig here to go after the pirates over here. Trinidad and Tobago, and then the leewards. And that'd be all the pirates in uh, in Americas. Let's save some money for next turn. And I also don't really know how we're going to actually win this, because victory conditions is control like however many territories. But we're going to start out by trying to take pirate territories. And um, after that, we can kind of build our armies from there using our trade money. But most important thing is to have a very strong navy so we can defend our trade routes. Um, yep. Some kind of prisoner died. We got our ships coming in. Some more things. Okay. So this fleet is actually pretty good. I'm going to drop them here. Drop these guys on it. And we're going to we're gonna sail for the port. There we go. These guys should be fine there. It's just pirate mobs. We can take care of them pretty easily. Um, what do we have? 4,000? What am I recruiting? Just a brig. Alright, let's go over to India. With our huge fleet. That's going to take a while. Uh, you know what? We haven't been doing research. Movement range. Reload time. Let's get the sextant. That'll be helpful. Moving around and such. Deep gem shaft. I think that's going to be worth it. Let's just check in with this. We can afford it, but... Yeah. Alright.
There we go. I can build this, but we don't really need it as a problem. So we'll just leave this alone and keep recruiting our navies, our flutes. Well, how are we looking here? Two flutes. This is going to be a killer navy. Actually, we need to check in with our... Yeah, see, look how much our navy upkeep is. So we need to actually get those things on trade routes pretty quick. Try to make some money without it being blockaded, which is taking away tons of our money. Pirates. Pesky pirates. Um, let's go up here. Got some Indiamans coming in. We're going to cancel that and make it a flute. That's going to raise our navy upkeep, but we're still making money. It's all about that money. Oh, here we go. I forgot about this. Alright. Let's just make a quick save. And here we go. Shouldn't be too difficult. Here we are. They always end up going on this side, so we're gonna do majority on this side and kind of just sweep around. is going to be boring, so. Here we go. They're not advancing. What, do you, what else do you expect from pirates? They're scared. Like little dogs. Here we go. Let's watch our line infantry. Good deal. They're scoring some hits, we'll admit. Nothing that the good old Dutch can't handle, though. Not a problem for the Dutch. Not a problem. We care not for the pirates. We care for their blood. Alright, let's speed this up. It's taking too long. It's just pirates. What are they gonna do? Stab me?
He's rushing right in. Can't even draw my lines. For goodness sakes. Alright. Let's just keep killing them. Pesky pirates, that's what I call them. They're pesky, and they're pirate shaped. So, pesky pirates. Makes sense, right? I know. Oops. It makes a lot of sense if you think about it. Speed it up again. Here they come. I got off a couple shots, a couple volleys. Put it around their flank here. There we go. And they're dead. I told you. The United Provinces, the Dutch East India Company cares not for pirates. We care only for tea. Okay. Thank you for coming and charging me for no reason. Next. Let's kill some pirates. Yeehaw. Do, 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 do. Fix bayonets and charge. Bye bye pirates. You're dead. Told you. That East India Company, baby. We don't mess around. I don't think there's any more enemies either. And that is what I call ultimate victory. Ultimate victory. I agree. That's what happens when you mess with the Dutch East India Trading Company. Ooh, Sweden and Denmark are at war. How interesting. Some pirates going everywhere. It's always some kind of pirate. Ah, an Indiaman. Region captured. Saxony is gone. Gone with the wind, I say. Let's replenish those boys. Ah, Capitaine. Let's auto resolve that, shall we? Make a quick save in case the RNG decides to. Uh oh. I think I'm out of disk space. I think.
think the problem is I'm out of disk space. All right, welcome back. Sorry about that. I think I've resolved most of everything. I had to load an old save and I just auto resolved the battles that we fought. And so I lost like one extra ship um, over here taking the port. But other than that, everything's exactly the same. So that's great. Um, I don't remember actually what battle we were fighting or I wanted to save first. Oh, it was that naval battle. All right, so I auto-resolve that naval battle. That's the only thing that's been skipped. Okay, so let's end the turn. And I'm just gonna do like 30 more minutes of recording and that'll be episode one, I guess. Because I'm all discombobulated now. Sorry about all the technical glitches, but we'll get them worked out for next time. Some more pirates running around. And... Leeward Islands. We need to get, get our troops back in. So let's do that first. Because I just had them go take that port real quick. And we'll replenish. And we can actually recruit a couple of brigs here, because they're better here. And let's check our income, looking good. And I think that's good, to be honest. We're doing pretty good in America. Um, let's just check this. And the rich, I guess, are very upset with the foreign occupation. But I don't really care, do I? There's no reason to. They're pirates. All pirates deserve to die. Cannon Foundry, what is this going to give me? Not really much of anything, to be honest. But the happiness might help. I think we're just going to end the turn. Just waiting for our flutes to be built. So we can send them on trade missions, to be honest. There goes some more Barbary States. Sweden. Cool. Up to 4,700 again. We got a nice size fleet here. I think I'm almost ready to send this thing out. I think I am ready. We're going to send this to East Africa. They're on the way. We're on our way. To find some gold for what makes the, the Dutch East Indies Trading Company is what they're going for. That's right. Ain't nobody mess with Dutch East Indies Trade Company. And here's our nice size fleet still operating. We can try to do a little bit of recruitment here just in case we got a war. Because I've had it happen and it's not helpful to be honest. I think we already have demi cannons in that army. Got a couple of cannons, got a couple of armies. Got some pikemen, which are useless. What is it, 1600? Still using pikemen, really? Dumb. 
Thakers, 46-4-3. So Demi Cannon's a better. Range 400 for him. 18-18. That's a fixed position, too. Yeah, we need some better, better technology, for goodness sakes. Give me an ordnance factory. 12-pounder, yeah. What did Driscoll give us? Eh, not much of anything. Let's keep building this trade fleet, shall we? Fleet, fleet. And then we can get a couple Indiamans. Because they're easier to make. Continue. And there we go. Let's continue. Got ourselves another flute over here, I think. Holy, this is a big trade fleet. I think we're good. We'll take our last flute and we're sending that thing. That thing's gone. These guys, you're going here. Continue. Bye bye. See, is this a trade route here? And are they blockading us? No, no, no. They're blockading the rest of us. Who cares about the rest of us? Let's continue. America. America. How are we doing here? Okay, we gotta keep our forces there for a while. But, not too shabby. Got a good navy here. Good sized navy. I don't think we're going to be upgrading that because it's just too much upkeep money. But we can get a Weaver's Cottage. Let's focus on our economy for a while. Let's continue. Take a shot every time he says, let's continue. <laughs> let's continue. Ooh, that's a nice French fleet. Ooh, that's a nice French fleet. Fleet arrived. Another fleet here. Let's go look at the Indian Ocean. Where's those pesky pirates? Alright, pesky pirates. You're dead. Let's kill us some pirates. Yeehaw! Don't mess with the Dutch. With the Dutch East India Trading Company. Here we go. Let's get them grouped up and in a line. Where's the wind going? Okay. I want to see one of these flutes. Holy schmoly. That thing's beautiful. Jesus. What are they wrapping in gold? They are ready to go. That's a Dutch East India Company ship right there, if I've ever seen one. Compare that to one of these little puny boats over here. Would you rather have this 
Or would you rather have this? I'll take this. Any day of the week. Okay? Any day of the week. Let's continue. Let's continue. Okay, let's kill some pirates, shall we? I say, we shall. What are they, two short run? Ooh, what in the heck is this? There we go. How many cannons he got? 48. Fifth rate. Oish. Don't do any damage. 132. 145. We'll get him. We'll get him eventually. Fifth rate cannot stand up to the mighty Dutch fleet. So speed it up. But be ready. Yeah, he's making some kind of a move here. I'm just going to keep sailing. We can maybe turn. sail between me, and I'm going to get there first. And I just raked him with canister. Rake, rake, I said rake. much so to be honest with you. We didn't really do much to me. We're just kind of doing nothing. But we're gonna turn around. Since they're doing their thing. This is good for me though. I get to use both guns. Both sides, excuse me. Trying to split up my cubes. It's not really gonna work though. I'm too good. I'm too good. We're gonna set him right through there. I know he's only a brig, but what you gotta do, you gotta do.
He's sinking. He surrendered. He's on fire. They're all swimming. Okay, GG. Heroic. That sounds good to me. Lost one. Lost two. Remaining two. Enemy killed. Captured. Okay, check. Get out of here. Order. Now you. We can't repair. But that's fine. We're going to a trade post. You can stay kind of damaged. Okay. Next order business. Let's make another trade fleet. Another couple of fleets. Let's go back home. How's this trade fleet going? This thing is ready. One more turn and it's ready to go. He's gonna stay. You know what? One massive fleet. Three legions. On the next turn, he sets sail to guard our trade routes and ensure the stability of the United Provinces for years to come. We only have a few more turns. You occupy my trade post. You bastard. <sighs> Portugal's destroyed. Oof. I can't go there? Gotta go here. Alright, he's making money now. How much? <gasps> Ooh. A lot of ivory. And the trade is open for business. See, that is what I call genius. Anyway, spices 1785, 105 pounds, 1100. 50 tusks. So I guess it's more profitable to actually trade in the East Indies. 1100, 1785. Well, I don't care. And we can't repair here. No. But they're going to sit there and make money. Thank you. Next. We're going to send. I mean, it's going to be a long journey for them, but. We're going to send our next trade fleet to the Indies. What does that give us? I think this one's ready to go. We're going to send them. We're going to dispatch them to the glorious... Dutch East Indies. Or should they guard our trades here? I like having one in every theater because you can kind of guard the trade posts. So one, two, three, four. It's going to take like six turns for them to get there. But I don't care. I don't care. Alright, let's see what we can do here. We should actually start getting an army built. That's good enough for now. Nice, nice, nice. 2200. That ain't good. 1300 only. Trade income 3300. Payments from diplomatic number 
detector. That's going to be upkeep 4,000. So we're not even making as much as we should from the Navy. That's the issue. But when this one gets there, it'll make the money. So I'm not worried. Let's continue. Let's see what our research is. Uh, want new industrial facilities with a sextant. That's good. Let's do... We should do canister shop. It's a good one to have. Military syllabus. I guess we need a little bit of military. So we'll do a plug bayonet, and let's save some money. Diplomacy. War declared. Accept. No, no, no. No, no. Westphalia, please. We're at war with West Falia. Not Spain, just the little tiny nothingness of West Falia. This tiny nothingness with our glorious army. Yeah, we need a bigger army. We need a bigger army. Um, okay. Start with that. Apparently Austria is at war with me too. Now we're at peace. Okay, so let's go. Diplomacy. Allies at war. Westphalia, Barbary, Pirate. Alright, not bad. Not bad. Allies, Great Britain. Not bad. Alright, so we're going to take a little bit of Westphalia. I mean, who cares? They're a little nothing state. And over here, we're making bank, okay? Over here, making bank. Over here, we're going to be making bank. Let's see what West Folly does. think they're so powerful. They can defeat the world's greatest trade empire. You can't defeat trade. Trade beats everything. But we will need to build a bigger army. We are going to go bankrupt in the process. But I think what we can do to avoid this problem is downsize our navy here. I know it's annoying, but this is such a good navy, though. I don't want to. <laughs> this is a good army, too. We'll leave, we'll leave this alone for now. How's the Ludwigs doing? Yeah, they need to be left alone for a minute. I think these guys can probably... Either get on a trade route or bugger off. Let's see what we can do over here. If we can get them on trade. Let's 
As long as France doesn't declare war, we'll be good. We'll be good. We'll see. European China, okay, I don't know what that means, but uh, sure. Get some horses. Yeah, but Austria and France can fight. We don't care about that. You guys, go to the East Indies. Get moving. Thank you, Capitan. All right, now you guys, there's a, what is this? There's a spy. Good job. We can march to take them, but I don't think we're ready yet. We need more infantry, not conscripts. Infantry. 71 next turn we'll make. Alright, let's see what we can do. Hello? There we go. It's working. Make some money. Kill some pirates. Bankrupt. New national leader. Excellent. Excellent. Here's our fleet. Uh oh, game's lagging again for me. We're good. Let's put them on a trade port. See how that does. More pounds. Which should make us 2,500. That is good. Oh dear. What is this? Navy upkeep, army upkeep. Oi. Oi. I think we need to downsize. Hmm. So do I need to sell these things? Not sure. I'm not sure. I think I need to research this, but we will figure it out for next time. When the bankrupt Dutch East India Trading Company figures out how to save itself from shore doom. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.